In preparation for next month's governorship election in Ekiti State, the Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, has commenced mock accreditation of intending voters. The bimodal voter authentication system, supervised by INEC Chairman Professor Mahmoud Yakubo and other management staff of the Commission, to ascertain its effectiveness, saw the electorate submit their voter cards for authentication while their fingerprints and faces were captured. Professor Yakubu, who monitored the exercise in the communities, expressed satisfaction at the process, saying it showed the readiness of INEC for the el coming election. Okay, this is part of the objective of visiting equity ahead of the governorship election. We said that we are going to do a mock test in a few local government areas to further test the functionality of the machines before the election. And so far, um, so good with the mock. We have visited one of the polling centers in Ado. Uh, we are here in Ikere. From here, we'll go to Irepodun, Ifelodun local government for the same reason. An overall assessment is that we are happy with the functionality of the machine. That is one. Number two, we are also here to look at the um, uh, readiness of our facilities for the election. As you can see, we have renovated the Ikere um, local government office, just as we have done with many other local government offices. These are not administrative facilities. They are also electoral assets, because on election day we will do the RA collation in our local government um, areas. So, so far so good. The third leg of the assessment is for us to see um, how far the PVCs that we have made available to voters have been collected. Remember without PVCs, citizens cannot vote on election day. And 74% of the PVCs have been collected so far, which is very, very encouraging indeed. With about three weeks to the election, that is very good. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.